Hey guys, this is Adam with Thoroughbred Diesel. Uh, getting ready to do an unboxing video. This is going to be for an SMB cold air intake. Part number on this intake is going to be 75-5058. This is going to be for a 2011-2012 uh, LML Duramax. Uh, so we're just going to set the box off to the side of the table and dive right into it. Uh, we'll call attention to the one part number on the upper corner right there. And other than that, everything else on this box is just a uh, standard brown cardboard box. We'll open our box up here and pull out the first thing. Okay, first thing we come to is just going to be the, uh, the first part of the tube coming out of the filter box. Um, this is what actually mounts up to the box. Nothing really special here. You do have a spot right there for your filter minder. I think the camera's catching it. Uh, other than that, you can tell just roto mold. And we're going to come to the next section of the tube next. Uh, nothing special about this really either. does have the S&B logo stamped into it right there. You do have a bung for your uh, map sensor right there. Large thing we're coming to is the actual filter box itself. You can see right here it has a spot for the lid. This is actually the opening back here that your tube fits into. It fits better to put it the right way. And you have your opening right here that your air comes into. This filter also has a underneath section that also pulls uh, air into it. Um, this kit is unique in that it comes with something called a box plug. We'll get that out of the box next. For those of you that might be concerned with too much heat coming into your air intake because of this, uh, this bottom entrance, this box plug uh, just simply pops in here. There's a hardware kit that allows you to mount it in there permanently. Um, this does reduce airflow, but it does also keep a little more heat out of your, your intake and your engine. So. We'll set the box off to the side over here. Next thing we're going to come to are the two silicone couplers that it comes with. Nothing special about those. And then part of the, one of the most important things is the actual filter itself. Uh, the filter will be in a separate box in this kit. Uh, we'd like to draw attention to the part number on the filter box down here. Make sure and write this down somewhere. If for any reason you ever do need to replace the filter, this will make it much easier and much more, uh, much quicker for you to be able to find the correct filter. Set the box off to the side. And as you can see, nothing special about this filter. It is. Uh, SMB's uh, oiled cotton. You can tell by the purple right there. Uh, I'd like to point out that this kit does come in a oil version or a dry version. It's absolutely no difference in the uh, the parts in the kit. The only difference whatsoever is the uh, media that makes up the actual filter itself. So we'll set the filter right here and we'll jump into the hardware packs. And first thing we'll pull out of the hardware packs are the four clamps right there. Uh, just a hardware pack with some bolts and washers. And this hardware pack is for the box plug. You can see the black clips right there that allow you to mount the plug in there. And the last hardware pack, which again is just some more bolts and washers. Uh, you'll see also that it does have a supplied uh, Torx bit in there for you. So that should help you out right there. And we'll get the last pack out now. First thing we're going to pull out are the instructions. Uh, as you can see, they do have full color step-by-step -step instructions. Very good, very easy to follow. Uh, having the full color at pictures make it a whole lot simpler. Uh, on the back of the instructions, you will also find um, an exploded view of the intake as well as the actual parts list laid out for you there. So we'll set those right back here. 
And then we'll pull out, this is the uh, the plastic, the plexiglass lid, which goes over top of the box over here. Um, it does have the cardboard on it right now to prevent scratching, but you can see the logo is etched into it already, uh, ready to go. So let's put that on top of the box. And then last thing you get in the box are two decals. One obviously being the SMB filters decal. And probably the more important of the two decals is a carb sticker. Uh, this carb sticker really comes in handy um, if you live in California or one of the other states that does really uh, strict fog testing. So this has been an unboxing video for SMB cold air intake. Part number again is 75-5058. Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure and follow us on uh, Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube. And if you have any questions about this intake, please just post them in the comments below. Thanks for watching.